is Roxy and I'm going to just try out this new Heidi Swap screen printing kit. Um, it's on clearance right now at Michael's for $7.99. And so this is what comes in the kit. You get an instruction booklet and there's like I don't know, four or five steps to it. Super simple. And that is basic then you get um, two tubes of um, screen pen ink a thing of washi so you can tape it down a scraper and three silk screens I think it's three or four there's two that you can cut apart yeah, there's four. And then note to self. And I love this. That's really pretty. And then I also purchased this set, which is Yes, Please, and Thank You. And enjoy the ride in a really cute bicycle. So, let's get crack a lack in here. I'm going to quick read the instructions, and that is place screen. Apply ink, use scraper to pull ink, peel off screen, and then you can complete an album. So when you place the screen though, you want to tape it down. And that's when the tips and tricks is to tape edges to mask edges art screen, of art screen I am guessing. Pull ink in one pass, pick up with the scraper to make cleanup easier. Getting started, sticky screen, stencil. Yeah, so the stencils are sticky backs, which, which are kind of nice. And then cleaning the screens, rinse immediately, blot with paper towel. Allow to air dry. Stickiness will return as screen dries. Return to backer sheet for storage. So that is it. So I think what I'm first, I think I'm going to do the, um, I'm going to do... Alright, so just put this down. Peel this off. I suppose you don't really have to worry about taping it because it's sticky and it's, it's, it's also stinky. Well, it is really sticky. I'm going to just go like that. Hopefully it's somewhat straight. Okay, then we will use, let's use yellow. It's going to be hard to do in one pass. I think I did the wrong side. Let's try this side. Hmm. Well, so much for one pass. I don't know why it gets all stuck up there. Really thick ink. Alright, we're gonna try it this way. Yeah, I don't know. The scraper's weird. Also not scraping, right? And it just automatically goes up there. So I don't know what how you do that, you combat that, but I'm just gonna keep scraping. Oh, 
Alright, so I'm going to go clean up this. Oops. I'm going to go clean up this silk screen. First we'll pull it off. That oh, looks cool. Alright, I'm going to go clean this off. Hi everybody, so I thought I would do some of the Heidi Swap um, screen printing. I'm really in love with it. It's super fun and super easy. Um, <clears throat> I did a few samples already. Oops. Yeah. So I thought I'd just do a couple more. So here are all the screen prints that I've gotten so far. I got a, They're all on clearance at Michael's. I love the bicycle. <clears throat> Insta love is cute. Life is beautiful. So, I think I'm going to do these. Just do a, that one's kind of cool. Enjoy the ride with the bike. Here's some bigger ones, the uh, polka dots. For fun background. Super cool. I love this. I did the map yesterday. That's really cool. <clears throat> That'd be cool for a travel one, of course, but even a patriotic kind of whatever. Just be your beautiful self. <clears throat> Alright, so I think kind of want to do a background and see how that, that, I can't remember what that background is called. Do I put it out here? This one. It's like uh, material or fabric. Kind of a woven look. <coughs> so, can I just do that up there? And it's hard because I'm having to get used to what the colors do on um, certain things. So we'll just try that. <clears throat> You don't have to use a lot, just a little, like about a... Well, first I gotta take it off here. They're super sticky, and even if you get them wet and wash them, they still... the stickiness stays. I'm gonna go up there. <clears throat> That's pretty. You do have to wash these screens quickly. <laughs> Heidi Swap suggests like a, a, you know, a wiper. I call them dighty wipes, but, or wipey dipes. But she suggests that. I kind of use a pan of water too. I just have it at the ready just in case. <clears throat> Alright, so. I just got to... You can even kind of pick it up and get the paint off your scraper. You just don't want to get it, I mean, you might want to get on your project, but try not to. If you wanted to, you could tape off this around here so you avoid the paper where the stencil is not taped down or stuck down. Just want to try to get all that. There. Let me go 
cool. So then I'm just gonna do a wipey. But I kinda like to do this thin also rinse it off. I just think it's a little um, clean better because look at how much is still on my in the screen. And you don't want it to stay in the screen because it'll clog all the little and what this is is they just it's a screen very fine mesh screen and then they burn an image which is the pink part onto the screen. And or I'll, they coat the screen and then burn the image onto it, and that takes away the pink part. <clears throat> so you don't want to get the ink anywhere on that. And I don't think you want to really keep it on here either. It's as little as possible. But you don't want to pull your screen either, like stretch it. So just carefully clean that off. And we will let that dry. Then I gotta clean this. That is the thing, you do need to clean in between so it's not like mixed media where you can just, you know, keep at it. You wanna clean between your project. And I noticed some. Yeah. I want to get, I can see green from the paper. There. Cool. Oops, see, yeah, I came off a little bit. I'm just going to use this pan, really of water to clean. I just kind of find it a little a little more cleanable. I'm gonna do that first and then you use the wipey type. Still some there a little bit. And you can see that some of the blue ink did get on this. Transferred a little bit. So probably I should wait a little longer to put another screen over it, but I think it'll be fine. <clears throat> then we'll try some letters. Oops. And you can actually, I mean, I've been doing this, is put the ink back in if there's a lot that's left over. I mean, I know you don't have to, but waste not, want not. There, that works for me. 
and then just clean this off. But the shimmer is the coolest part of the ink, I think. All right, so then... Probably a lot just for the lettering I have, but well. Ooh, darn it. Well, it's just got sticky there. But I can always put, you know, like a little nail dot or something there. But isn't that cool? So I just got to go slower when you pull off the tran or the screen print. The screen, whatever. But how cool. So, um, I was going to try some of these journaling cards I've got from Becky Higgins. Trust me, if I wasn't taping this, everything would be going perfectly smooth. Paper went to ripped off, etc. Anybody who films knows. As soon as you turn that camera on, this is what we've got to watch out for too. Is a dirty, um, like I've got my uh, sheet here, my you know little craft sheet, and it's got stuff stuck on it from old projects, like old paint and stuff. So. I gotta get this cleaned up better, I think. My mat. But I think it'll be okay. There. I think you got stuff cleaned up enough, but you don't. Oops. Alright, so I'm gonna try. <clears throat> Here's some other ones that I've made with gold. Isn't that pretty? Wish you could see the shimmer of the ink. Is that upside down? <laughs> so those turned out cool. I 
I'm gonna just use this up. Hopefully it'll. See, there's still a ton left. Do a little more, it looks like it got messed up here. this a try I am loving it I think the opportunities you can also do it on fabric I was gonna try a little t-shirt I have so I'll do that in another video because I can't remember where I put the little t-shirt it's in my to-do pile somewhere but that is the Heidi Swap screen print and she had a Christmas um, set out last year, not this past Christmas, but the 2014, I think, and I wish I could get my hands on it because it's really cute and I think it'd be fun to make some cute projects for Christmas. Um, so I hope you give it a try and thanks for watching. Bye. Say, I'll never leave them square.